Hey, this is Daniel from Protobots.com and this is how to fix invalid meshes. So, what is an invalid mesh? I'm sure you have encountered many cases of bad geometry like non-manifold, uh, which is... well, for example, uh, more than two faces sharing the same edge and double vertices, which is basically two or more vertices sharing the same space when they shouldn't. And, but those are, aren't actually invalid uh, mesh types, just bad practices and, and of course they produce problems, but they are valid within, the, um, uh, within, within Blender's modeler. What we got here is not. So this, uh, I believe, this isn't. This is this isn't even possible to recreate in Blender, but this model must have been loaded from another software, which probably isn't as good as a modeler. So you see what we have here. Uh, it uh, looks like an obvious case of. Uh, double faces. So, two faces uh, lying in the same uh, space. Uh, the problem with this is that if I go and do a, a remove doubles operation, I get zero vertices removed. So what is happening? If I go and check here, there aren't actually any vertices uh, being um, in the same space. So if I select all four vertices uh, confirming this, this face, and, and I could do it with almost any other face in this mesh. So I got my expected four vertices, my expe expected four edges, but two selected faces. So that is the problem. We got um, two faces that share the same edges and the same vertices and uh, as I was saying this is not even possible to do with Blender tools so Blender has no way to fix this so this is a real problem because if, if we do remove doubles nothing happens there is really no way to do this except manually uh, deleting one of of the faces and you see there's another one there so that's that was the problem but that would be a huge manual task here because uh, all of these faces have the same problem if you see you got four vertices selected two faces so what we do we do um, yeah as I was saying this is not possible to do in blender from the UI but there is a, a hidden tool in the console. So open Python console and let me save here and we will access it. It is located, uh, it is a, a, an operator located in the uh, data type. So let's access the mesh. So first bpy. bpy means we are accessing the Blender uh, library in the Python modules or the, the Blender module. This is the BPI's Blender related things within Python. So let's use the context because we want the active, the selected uh, mesh. So context dot active object. Then uh, right now we have the object which is called print but we need the mesh inside the object. So we, don't, we do not need this, but we need this. Uh, so dot data. And now we got meshes print. So we are very close. Now we use a tool called validate. And this uh, has to be like um, invoked as uh, like a function so double parenthesis and run it and it returned true this true means it found uh, invalid geometry and fixes it 
So if if uh, I uh, if I move the viewport and refresh, you see that we got rid of the flickering. Now we got normals pointing wrong, but that's something we can fix with the normal tools in Blender. That's no problem. Let's use a sub uh, subdivide. You see, it it just uh, has normal problems, but no weird flickering. And if I use the tool again, it will return false because it didn't. Uh, it ran, but it didn't find anything really wrong with it. So now we got a valid mesh. And I hope this will be useful for you sometime. Uh, when you get a crappy... Uh, well, or a, um, a mesh model in some crappy software. So, use Blender! <laughs>